the next step to calculate for the bending moment at the center of interest span so you can see here we have the concrete cover of 25 mm and then the effective depth for the slab is 205 okay so this is the depth so how to get the effective depth of the tissue so this d equal to slab thickness has minus concrete cover minus diameter of main rebar so for the initial design for the, you need to assume the diameter of the main reinforcement bar and then at the support 305 is three, uh, previously the head is 350 eh? so 350 minus the concrete cover 25 minus diameter of a bar okay after that <coughs> for the center of interest span positive moment you can refer to the topic on the reinforced concrete design one okay so for the continuous slab for the positive moment we have this coefficient 0 0.00 0 0.063 fl so f is the point load l is the effective span that we already discussed on the previous slide so by using this 0 0.063 multiplied by f multiplied by l we have 247 kilonewton meter so this positive moment acting at the middle after that we need to distribute this moment home at for the certain person at the middle span and then the balance the support first we need to get the width of the middle strip okay middle strip so we have 6.5 is the distance from column to column minus the width of the drop so we have 4 meter which is greater than half of the panel dimension so that the the, the proportion with moment taken by the middle strip can be taken as 0 0.45 so this value we can get the, from table 8.7 okay 0 0.45 means 45 percent and then we need to adjust the value with this uh, with the width of the middle strip divided by the span divided by 2 we have 0 0.455 so based on this the adjust value now we know that the positive the, the the contribution from positive moment to the interest span is 0 0.55 or or 55 percent as you can see from this slide you can see from this slide so we have the for example for the negative moment at the column okay the s column and in our case we have the negative moment in the internal column because we have the internal internal uh, span so for the internal span we have negative moment with between 60 to 80 okay and then at the middle strip 40 to 20 and then positive moment is 50 to 70 and then at the minister 50 to 30 percent in the in the example in the previous slide we take 45 percent is between 50 and 30 after we do the adjustment by using the span divided by by 2 in this table 8.1 you can see how to get the moment at the middle interest span of 0 0.063 fl okay from this slide you can see the middle strip positive moment is 0 0.55 multiplied by positive moment 2.247 so we have 136 km meter this for the middle strip so the balance for the column strip is 1 minus 0 0.55 so 45 percent contribute to the column strip that is 111 km meter after that calculate for the reinforcement bar first need to get the k value k value equal to moment divided by bd square fck okay so because the width of the middle strip is 4000 so b equal to 4000 mm and then effective depth of the slab is 20.5 and then the concrete grade is 25 so we have the k is 0 0.032 and then this one zero this value is less than 0 0.05 so we can consider the z equal to 0 0.95 
So by using this equation, AS equal to moment divided by 0 over 7 FYKZ, we can get the AS is 1605 square mm. So because this at the middle strip means for the positive moment, we need to provide the first mean bar at the bottom side of the slab 1605 mm square mm. And then by using this, this value, we can get the number of riba. So 1605 divided by area of 1 diameter 12 mm. So we get this, uh, the value and then just round up to 16. So we have the actual, the AS provided is 1809 square mm. Okay. And then this must be distributed evenly across the 4 meter width of the uh, middle strip so that the spacing around 250 mm. After that, by using this, it's the same equation, we change the moment with the 1, 1, 1 kN meter to get the K value and then to get AS. And then so that we have the AS required for the column strip is 1310 square mm. Then again, we need to determine the number of the riba is the area 1310 divided by area of diameter 12. Okay, so we run up to uh, 12, so that we have the 12 diameter 12. And then distribute evenly across the 2.5 width of the column strip because the width of the column strip is 2.5. So we have the reverse number with the spacing of 110. 10 mm. Thank you.